Hello YouTube, this is Bobby, I'm a Ravens fan, um, today has been a sad day, um, Terrell Suggs signed with the Arizona Cardinals, that is a very sad thing to be happening, I, I have, I'm speechless, I'm, I'm hurt, I don't know why, it's been 16 years in my eyes, he will always be a Raven. Um, he, he has been there through thick and thin. He He's a very good player. And hats off to him and good luck to him. And we do play Arizona at home this year. So he will be back in Baltimore to verse the Ravens this coming season. Now, we have a whole bunch of trades to get to. Um, first, um, starting yesterday, Antonio Brown went to Oakland. That, uh, came by no surprise. I figured that Oakland pretty much had him the whole time. Um, there was only a couple other teams that were interested. Um, 49ers, um, Ravens. Uh, I believe the Jets were interested in Buffalo, but uh, he did not want to go to Buffalo. So, that's a no. So, um, trades that happened today, Nick Foles is signing with Jacksonville. Um, that came pretty much by no surprise either. It's been about two weeks now that they pretty much said Jacksonville. So, Jacksonville all the way. So, um... Hats off to him. I did like him as an Eagle, but now I do like him in Jacksonville. Um, and I think he'll fit well there. Um, he has a couple of good wide receivers. Um, and basically, I'm just saying good luck to him. Um, Landon Collins to Washington. Um, I did not expect that. Um, there were a bunch of teams that were interested in Lando Collins. Um, and I didn't see Washington on the list. I was surprised. Um, we also have Deshaun Jackson renewing with the Eagles. Um, basically, you know, his heart was probably with Philly the whole time. So... That's pretty much a good signing for the Eagles, and they did need a wide receiver. Um, technically, no, because they did have Deshaun Jackson earlier, um, but they also have Alshon Jeffries and uh, Nelson Aguilar, so that's a pretty good receiving core. Um, other trades happening today, Malik Jackson is going to the Eagles also. Um, again, the Eagles have a really good defense, I believe, and with that addition, that helps the Eagles. Um, we also have Jamison Crowder to the New York Jets um, to uh, try to uh, get a better wide receiving core. Uh, we also have Frank Gore to the Bills, um, running back. We also have Trey Flowers signed with the Detroit Lions. And we also have Dante Fowler signed with the Rams. I believe all these trades will officially happen tomorrow. Or no, I'm sorry, Wednesday. And... That is just crazy how all these trades happened in one day. I mean, but basically, you know, free agency hasn't even started, and all these trades have been happening lately. And it's just, it's very sad to see my teammates as Weddle, Suggs, um, Crabtree, CJ Mosley might even not return. It's just, Zedarius Smith is not going to return. 
it's just, it's very sad because I don't know what, I mean, I, I trust Eric DaCosta in what he's doing, um, but sometimes I just, I just don't get it of why the Ravens, um, make these decisions. They should, they should have at least, in my eyes, they should have at least paid C.J. Mosley. And possibly Terrell Suggs. Those are the two you have to wrap up. Eric Weddle had a couple... He, he, he was good, but he also had... You know, he blew us two seasons that we could have made it to the playoffs. So, um... Hats off to Eric Weddle. I mean, he, he was really a good player. I really miss him. And I, I wish him well. And I really, I really heartbroken about the Terrell Suggs trade. Um, I was hoping to get Terrell Suggs back in Baltimore, and also C.J. Mosley. But it doesn't seem like any of those players are going to sign with the Baltimore Ravens. Um, I believe that we have a pretty good shot at getting Le'Veon Bell. Um, I, I don't ask why, but I, I just believe that we do have a really good shot at getting Le'Veon Bell um, just because of all these trades happening. You know, they're saving up cap space. Um, and I'm very um, excited um, for Wednesday because I think Bell is going to sign as, as soon as as possible, Wednesday, Thursday, if not Friday. Um, that would be a big celebration day for me. Um, because I just think that when the Ravens guys come to the Steelers or when the Steelers guys come to the Ravens, it just gives the... Um, not that the Ravens and Steelers have a big rivalry. They basically... It hypes up the rivalry even more that one of those players goes to the other team. Um, so with that being said, um, that's basically it in all the trades today. Um, like I said, and I'm going to say it all again, it's been a very sad day for me. And I, I just, I, I wish all my former teammates good luck. Um, and like I said, I think um, all these players that are with new teams now are really good fits. Besides, I, I like I said, I did not see Lyndon Collins going to Washington. Um, my reports had Lyndon Collins either going to the Jets or possibly, possibly even the Ravens were in the mix. Um, I did not see Washington on the list. Um... With that being said, um, I'm going to go now. Um, this is my second YouTube video. I will be getting better at making YouTube videos, hopefully. Um, I know I'm basically stuttering a little bit, but I'm hoping to get better. I never made videos in my lifetime on a social media account. Um, so with that being said... Um, I'm going to go now. Um, I will keep everybody updated on the trades that are going to happen. Um, there's probably going to be more trades. The Le'Veon Bell trade. And I don't even know where um, CJ Moses is going to end up. Um, so with that being said, um, YouTube, I'm going to go now. And... See you in the next video. I will be posting sometime this week, if I'm able to, a video um, of the, my NBA predictions for the playoffs. I will be making from 1 to 8 who's going to make the playoffs. And I actually also will be predicting the final records for each team. Okay, with that being said, um, I'll see you in the next video. Like, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions, hit me up. Um, Instagram is Bobby Palmer 
55. All right, thank you very much. See you in the next video.